Hello, and once again welcome back to Phobia St. Dymphna Hotel, this time for part 4. And this time I'm wondering if I'm going to have to kill another performer in this video. I certainly hope not, because that pianist guy wrecked me. He ruined me. He nearly killed me twice and took so much ammo to go down. So yeah, hopefully we don't have to go through anything like that in this video, but I guess we'll see, won't we? Anyway, looks like we're going up here. So who's lying in wait? No one? Mm, not yet, anyway. Alright, through here? No. Ah, that would be the, the mezzanine, right? And what have we got here? Looks like a puzzle. Looks like a box. In fact, it looks like a puzzle connected to a box. You see that wire there? Hmm. I guess we have to access this area from the other side. Yeah, that would be, what, mezzanine area 2 or something like that? It looks like we might be able to go up there, but what about through this gate? I might be able to unlock it, but I need to find the key. Right. Well, let's go up here, shall we? Okay. Again, no one lying in wait. And here we are, above the piano, above the stage. This way? This way it is. What a convoluted way around. <laughs> oh, hang on. Oh, I missed these last time. There you go. Wonderful. Thank you very much to anyone leaving their comments down below, letting me know where I've left things behind, by the way. I might be able to go back to some of those areas pretty soon. Maybe in this video. What we got here? Oh, it's sheet music. Okay. Maybe that's for the... I was going to say, maybe that's for the piano down there, but it's a memory. Another memory. All right. I think they're just collectibles, essentially. Okay. I don't suppose I can unlock this from this side, can I? No, I need the key still. All right. Can I... Oh, yeah. What's in the box? Oh, there's a cassette tape. All right, there you go. Oh. Got some ammo down here. There's... Oh, there's a key. Theatre backstage. But of course my inventory's full. And look at this. Right, yeah, this is the button that takes me up to the eighth floor. Ah, oh, man. Okay, well, you know what? The box isn't too far away, is it? So let me just go back down. Let me sort out my inventory. Let's listen to the tape. Then I'll come back, grab the key. There you go. That's got the new tape in it. So let's have a listen, shall we? I saw her again. The girl. In the gas mask? Everyone here is terrified of her. And I don't blame them. Every time she shows up, we all feel some kind of intense pain. It's hard to describe, really. Hmm. But, honestly, I don't think she's trying to hurt us. From what I've seen, it seems like she's looking for something. Or maybe someone. Hmm. This time, when I saw her, I swear, I swear she was trying to speak to me. But the only word I could make out was daddy. Daddy. I, uh, I blacked out before I could hear anything else. When I woke up, she was already gone. I, I, I don't know what to think. If she's really not trying to kill us, what could she possibly be looking for? Hmm. He's got to be talking about the same girl I've been seeing. Yeah. What the hell does she want? Her daddy, by the sounds of it. Am I her daddy? Hmm. So, here we are. Let's pick up this metal key. The theater's backstage. I suppose that's going to open this door as well, right? Yes. Okay. All right. And what about the connecting door? God, there's a chest right there. Ah, why didn't I pick up the key first? Right, yeah, what about this one here? Okay. But surely this would also unlock the door to mezzanine 2, right? No? Really? Oh, okay, I'm going to have to discard it. Right, I decided to put my machine gun away, by the way, because I figure, you know, I'm probably not going to step into another boss fight anytime soon. So yeah, freed up some slots that way. Right, so we've got yet another button. This one goes to floor eight. There you go. Is that it? Is that all we're going to find around here? I think so. All right. Also, I've picked up 
the room key to number 404. I wonder if I can maybe go back down there, now that I'm not getting chased. I might get on with that soon. Let's see. Alright, so we're going to have to go back down here and find our way to the elevator, right? Ooh, okay, right. <laughs> We've got some new spawns to deal with by the looks of it. There you go, three bullets and he is down. Is he the only one? He appears to be, at least right now. Uh, okay, so yeah, let's go fix the button. So, 8 is going to go up there. Alright. Um, but yeah. I want to check out 404. How do I do that? I might actually have to go back to floor 1 and work my way up the stairs. Here we are then. Floor 1. Any new enemies down here? Not that I can see. Right. So, yeah. Let's work my way up this way, back to the fourth floor. I think this is the only way, right. Um, that's where you get cornered. I actually think I want to go this way. So yeah, turn around, wouldn't you? Thank you. Give me a few good shots to your chest. There you go. I think you're down, and I think you're down for good. I think it was back here that someone mentioned that I left something as well, and I noticed it during editing. Uh, yeah, there you go. Some machine gun bullets over here. Right. Uh, I think I need to go through this wall? Is that right? Seems so. Okay, awesome. Um, actually, seeing as I don't have the machine gun right now, why am I carrying around machine gun bullets? That doesn't really make a great deal of sense. I'll store those. Up here. Okay, that's going to take us to floor three. And then finally to floor 4. I think 404 is just over here, isn't it? Right. Here we are, 404. Okay. Let's hope this is worth the backtracking. Okay. What we got? Uh, there's a Rubik's Cube. Don't tell me I have to solve this. Hmm. Okay, it's not a puzzle, it's not a memory, it's just a Rubik's Cube. Alright, fair enough. What we got in here? Uh, ooh! We got pliers, not bolt cutters exactly, but I think they're going to work just the same. Wonderful. Okay, an upgrade item that's more spherical than usual. That's five. Hell yes! Okay. Anything else? Let's pull out the camera and have a look. Uh, I don't think so. Is there some detail to this that I can only see with the camera? No? Okay. Right. Well, hey! There you go! Let's take a look at those pliers. Can be used to cut small chains. Right. So where have I seen all those small chains? If only I could take the elevator. I, I still would need one more of these. Um... Right. Yeah, thinking about it, where have I seen those small chains? I think there were quite a few on floors 5 and 6. So, I suppose I need to run all the way back down to go back up. It's just one more floor that I want to traverse, but... Yeah, without that elevator, I'm going to have to go down to go back up. Here we are then, back on floor 5. Which is completely blocked up, so I can't go back through there and... Oh, man. I'm going to have to go up to six and then down the stairs, I suppose. Right. Were there some chains over here? I can't remember, to be honest. That's the save area. That's right. Back here, maybe? Hmm. Oh, right. The bricked up doorway. Oh, all right. <laughs> it's not a bricked up doorway now, is it? Right. Let's give this a try, shall we? Hey, there you go. Alright, so we can snap that. And through we go. Right. Well, let's get on the other side of the brick wall before we decide to uh, pull the camera away. Oh, it is a little bit different, you know. Okay, hang on. 
Another upgrade item. Brilliant. Another one. Is that alcohol? All right. What else have we got? Okay. There's a there's a box back here. A, a chest. Oh, the padlocks. Right. Hang on. Oh, come on. Really? Surely you could snap that off. Hmm. I guess we need to find, like, a, a master key for all of those. I don't know. Oh, God. Holy shit. We got a load of bodies in here. Yeah. I think they've been here for a while. Man. There you go. I suppose that's why this was bricked up, to hide all this away. Can we get over there? No? Alright. Um. Oh. Right. Let's look at the hanging one. Let's see. On the other side of things, it looks fairly normal. It looks like we got a, a case down here. Oh, it's a case that needs a combination, too. Three digits? Man, there are so many safes and cases that I, I just don't know the combination to. Now, it looks like we can't go through there. And it's blocked up on this side as well. Oh, hang on, there is a three, though. There's a three. Would that be the first number? Four. Three, four. Okay. Is there something hiding behind you? <laughs> three, four, bloodstain? Three, four something? Hmm. Okay. Right, let's have a look at these drawers down here. What are we going to find? Shotgun shells? Very nice. Anything in the cupboard? Ah, yes! Pistol rounds and an eight. So it's, uh, three, four, eights? Or four, eight, three? Or... Right, it's some sort of combination. Let's have a little look, shall we? There you go. It was four, eight, three. And what's this? Ah, oh, silly me. I can't pull away the camera. I've got to have the camera out to get it. It's another upgrade item, another spherical one. Does that mean it's a... It's another five. Wow. Hell yes. Okay, amazing. So let's see. Improvements? I got 20 points to spend now. Brilliant. And I guess, yeah, I could upgrade my machine gun. Uh, looks like there's one more thing to find. I guess there's going to be maybe one more weapon? Don't know where that's going to be. Honestly, I kind of want to increase the power of my shotgun again. I like shotguns, you know? And it seems like we do actually find quite a few shells around, so... Yeah, I'm going to increase the power. And maybe improve the accuracy of the shot as well. There you go. Yeah. I'm pretty happy with that. Still can't get that open. But, hey, not bad, right? Not bad at all. Right. Let's go back through and let's see if we can maybe find some more chained off doors. There's another one on this floor. Which is the toilet, right? It's through there. But I think there might be one or two above me on floor six. So let's head up there. Okay, right. Here we go. Here's another example. Should be able to cut this now as well. All right. In we go. Okay, that... Ooh. Bunk beds. All right, we'll check that out in a moment, but hang on. A strong bandage down here. Very nice indeed. And there you go, there's another safe. What does this one need? A three-digit combination. Something down here? Okay, oh, there's a book. Medicine in medieval times. Yeah, let's put that away. I don't think I'll need that with all the strong bandages that I'm finding. Uh, let's see. Something over here? A stethoscope. Interesting. Maybe that's going to help with a, a safe or two? Or, no, maybe that's another memory. Okay, some gauze, a piece of plaster. I got some alcohol, actually, so yeah, hang on. Let's combine them all. Like that, and there you go. I've got three of these now. Brilliant. Something down here? Maybe. Then again, maybe not. What about the other side? No, can't open those ones, apparently. All right. <laughs> All right. What does that mean? Do not use the green herb. It's toxic. Oh boy. Right. Well, let's see this on the other side, shall we? Okay. No green herb to speak of this time. But we do have some more shotgun shells. There you go. All right. Something down the toilet, maybe? No? Ah, oh, never mind. 
Right, so yeah, I think I saw bunk beds here. I did. I did. Alright. Some lockers? Oh, interesting. Okay, uh, what does this need? It might be missing a handle or something like that, actually. What about the others? Okay. Something down here? Uh, not that I can see, no. Hmm, alright. What else? Can we open these drawers? Nah, unfortunately not. There's a phone, which of course doesn't work. Can we open this case? No. Anything on the beds? No. Another body in a body bag, though. Yeah. Curious. Very, very curious. Right. Let's have a little look. I don't believe there were any more doors with chains. Not here. Maybe right at the beginning? No, I, I, I don't think so. I don't think so. Let's go down the stairs. Let's go down to floor five. And let's see if we can access that toilet, shall we? Right. Yeah, this is how I'm going to bypass that blockage. I guess it's going to be through here, isn't it? That's right. Yeah, yeah, that's it. The one with the axe on the door. Right. So. There you go. Now let's see. Before I open the door, I'm curious. I can't discard this quite yet, so there's definitely more chains to cut. Alright. In we go. Okay. Thankfully there's a hole in the wall, so it's not a complete dead end. Alright. Looks like a fancy flashlight to me, but I can't pick it up. Okay. Is that... Okay, that's an upgrade item, I think. There you go. There's another one. Ah. Alright, is this my way across? No? I can't cross that gap? Apparently not. No, alright. Uh, do I drop down? or? I uh, probably don't want to drop down, really. Um, okay. What else have we got here? Something in the drawers, something in the cupboards. Man, I am not liking those noises that I'm hearing. Another one! Another one! What's that, four? I got four, okay. I know that guy wrecked me in the last boss fight, but I'm not that bad, guys. <laughs> I don't know if I need four strong bandages. Uh, probably will, to be honest. Um, okay. Well, let's see. Things haven't changed? No, I don't think things have changed. Even holding the camera, I can't cross over, so no, that's not what we need to do. Back here? Through the hole? Can't go through any more walls? There's another flashlight, but again, I can't pick that up. Right, okay. Well, there you go. There you go. Here we are. Floor 8. And I think this must be Statue Hall. Stephanie? She should be here, right? She's abandoned me again. <laughs> Oh, man, I just really can't trust her, can I? Okay. Well, this is it, right? This is this is Statue Hall, with a statue looking like that. Right, what else we got around here? Surely there's something. To be honest, I was half expecting to get up here and, you know, await another phone call. What's through here? Can't seem to access it, actually. Okay. Can't open the drawers. No, nope. all right. What we got back here? Let's take a look. Something down here in the cupboards? Uh, yes, there might be, actually. Master Christopher was right, as always. The cleansing process he foresaw has now begun. Davy's time as leader of the Sacred Trail is over, and his son will stay to protect the girl in our absence. My only hope is that those who follow in our footsteps continue our work well. It is time for my trail to end. I'm not afraid, for I know the promise of resurrection and everlasting life will be fulfilled. This is the great promise of the Master, and the Master does not fail. To the principle of free will. And Akleto again. Wow, okay. Yeah, this is uh, very cult-like, isn't it? Let's see. Okay. More plaster. That's good, because I've got quite a lot of gauze. Another safe. This time it's four digits. Hmm. Okay. Something over here? Oh, are we gonna steal from the till? 
Oh no, hang on. Um, looks like there's a bit missing on the side. Can I clip it? No? Okay. <laughs> that's not the answer. It looks like that's blue screen, so we can't access the emails or anything like that. Uh, do we want a drink? Get some water? No? Oh, no, there's no water to collect. Right. So there's nothing else back here? Alright. Um, over here? Oh, no. Look at this. I don't actually have the white key card with me, but to be honest, I, I don't know what the password would be. Something over here? Oh, this would probably be the password. Use the password corresponding to the day of the month. Right. What day is it? Does it tell me in my notes? Hmm. I don't know if it does. I don't know if anything's dated, quite honestly. In my room at the very beginning, I did see a calendar. I can't remember exactly which date it was, though. Hmm, okay. Right, well, I'll have a little play around with that a little bit later on. What have we got, then? What's up here? Stephanie? The administration room. Ooh, fancy. Alright, through here, then? Ah! No. Wait, what's this? A handle. A cash register handle. Oh, that was what was missing on the side. Yes. Oh, it's not a phone call this time. It's a message. Roberto, I have to run. If you made it here, the key to the administration room is in the reception area. First floor. You have to get that key. Okay. And the handle's gonna help me with that? There's no way! Did she really just leave me here to die? You know what? Fuck this! <laughs> there has to be some way to escape through the reception area. I'll find a way out of here on my own. Okay. To be honest, I'm with you. Yeah. Uh, so, let's see. Round here. Right, let's see if we can put this back. Okay. Is there cash inside? No, not this time. There's a key. To Mezzanine 2. Alright. I was wondering if that was going to be the key to the reception area downstairs, but Mezzanine 2. Okay, that works too. Um, so, right. I suppose I'm going to have to go to 7, and then we're going to have to work our way up, right? Right. I, I also need to find a chest so I can pull out that white key card again. I want to get through that door. Need to find out what day it is, though. Hmm. Right, so let's see. Let's go all the way up here. And all the way to the very top. Uh, actually, there is a chest here, isn't there? Right, so Mezzanine 2 is over there. I'm going to go this way. I'm going to have a look at the chest first. I'm going to actually get out that key card. Yeah, let's see. It's... There it is. Right. Um, I'm maybe going to put away the pliers for now. I'll save them. I'll, I'll leave them for later, much like I'm doing with the rod and the crowbar, stuff like that. Freeze up another couple of slots. Maybe I should pull out the machine gun again? I don't know. Oh, I really, really don't know. Right, okay. Let's see. Mezzanine 2. That's going to give us access to that area that I saw at the beginning of the video, right? That's going to give us access to that puzzle, that box, and the enemy. Right, okay. Come on. Whoa, 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 and whoa. Wow, okay, yeah. They can charge and they can hurt. Jeez Louise. Right. Let's open this up. Let's see if we can get into that box. So is that the only use for the key? It's disappeared, I guess so. Right. Yeah, I can't use the box, but it's got a skull and crossbones on it. Oh dear. Am I going to be a pirate if I open this? I kind of hope so. Okay. Um. Right. We have to match the shapes, do we? Um. Interesting. It's not going to be that one. It's not going to be that one. 
No, no, no. I'm just looking for what matches up on the top two. Looks like a, a screw or something. No. Okay, we've got one of those. Uh, let's see. Okay, I might be onto something with this, actually. Have we got a cross? Yeah, we do, we do. Okay. And then that... Hey, that all lines up. The outside lines up. So this one in the middle will also have to line up, right? Hey, there you go. That wasn't too difficult. And we're rewarded with yet another key. Not a pirate outfit, unfortunately. But this is the key to the reception. Right, okay. Are we just going to get out of here? Is it going to be that simple? I don't think I can leave this place behind. Not without solving all of its mysteries. Alright, here we are, back on floor six. What I'm going to do is actually go back to my room to have another look at that calendar. I can't remember exactly what date it is, or what date it's meant to be. Actually, there may have been some sort of time skip, so I don't know if this is actually going to pay off, but right. Through this hole? Um, right. What we got here? 6749. 6749, I don't... I don't recall what this is for. Am I hearing an enemy as well? Oh, right. Oh, what? oh, hang on. Well, this is something that I've missed. In fact, I think someone did mention this, right. Okay, let's deal with that enemy, then I might be able to open that safe. Let's see. Okay, he's down, and I think he's down for good. Six, seven, four, nine. Yeah, okay, hang on, hang on. Here we are. Six, seven, four, nine. It works. Okay, what's in here? Oh, man. What is that? That adds slots. How many? One. It's better than nothing, honestly. And another bandage, I think? Hey, brilliant. Okay, well, you know what? If the uh, if the calendar thing doesn't work out, I'm still glad that I came back. Right, we're going to have to go through this hole using the camera. And then we're back through here. Yeah, there you go. I'm getting so nostalgic for this area. Here we are. Back again. Right. So is it the 18th? I don't know. I honestly don't know. But that's what I'm going to try. Oh, jeez. Whoa. Since when did you guys get here? Oh, goodness. All right. There you go. Three bullets apiece, and they're down. Is there a third? Where the hell did those guys even come from? That door remains closed, so... Oh, no idea. Absolutely no idea. Right, so let's see. We are going to try... Uh, 7682, I suppose. Here we go. Got the card this time. 7682. I'm noticing in the top right that there's a date on this keypad. It's the 19th. So I didn't actually need to go back there at all. I'm glad I did for the slot, but... So, hang on. It's 19, is it? What? 1102. Let's try this again. Okay. So what's through here? Oh, the stairs? Oh, it's the fucking stairs. It's just a shortcut. Oh, man. Oh. <laughs> I was hoping it was going to be something a little better than that, to be honest. And that's it for the white card. Right, well, okay. I guess I, guess I can discard it. There you go. we got two free slots. Now, I suppose, what we want to do is use this reception key down on floor one. Okay. Any new enemies? Yes, in fact, there are. I think the game knows I need to come down this way, so yeah, there's a there's a few more things in the way. Oh boy, shooting in the dark there, but it paid off. He's down. Right, okay, so back down here. And then to reception. Oh, okay. I see two of them. One of you, I think, was thrown away by Lobster Man, right? Yeah. One of you was picked up earlier. Oh 
man, there's three of them down here, at least. Okay, well, I've got quite a lot of ammo, so... Finally putting it to some good use. Made this a little bit more accurate than normal, didn't I? So, yeah, it's paying off. There you go. Oh, how dramatic. <laughs> Just so long as you die like the others. Okay. So, let's see. Are we going to the staff area? No? Well, that's all blocked up. It's got to be this way, hasn't it, I suppose? Uh, yep, yeah, okay. So, here we are. Got the key. Right. Are we getting out of here, though? I kind of hope not. We can't leave it like this. Okay. I'm sorry, can I not leave? Well, sorry, can I not enter the hotel? Do I have to leave? I can't seem to get back. Maybe I've passed the point of no return. I don't know if I like that or not, to be honest. Right. Let's see, let's get this open, shall we? Alright. More blocked up windows. I see the entrance is well and truly blocked up, so I, I don't think we are leaving, at least not using the conventional means. Is that... Okay, there's a chest over there. Hmm. Shotgun shells. All right. Anything back here? Anything useful? No? Okay. I think I see... Is that a book? Which one's this? The Many Worlds. Oh, yeah. Tell me about it. Pistol rounds. Okay. the other side. Oh, hang on. What's this? Esteemed guest list. Names and professions. Wait. That's a lot of R's. That's a hell of a lot of R's. <laughs> hmm. Okay. I'm going to take that with me. Interesting. Very interesting. Okay. No bell this time, so I can't call that guy from the beginning. He's not lurking around here, though, I suppose. Okay, that's all blocked up. What does this say? You have no choice. No choice. All right, yeah, that's all blocked up. So, through here? No, that's locked. And yeah, that's well and truly blocked. Uh, right, okay, so let's take a look at this with the camera. Ah, not so blocked up anymore, is it? Why am I nervous going through here? Don't know. Nothing to find? No, there's got to be something. Look at this. It looks like I could smash that window pane and escape, but I don't want to do that. Not yet. Okay. Oh, man. I, I put away the key. Although there is a chest just across from me, so right. Uh, anything else around here? Machine gun bullets? Right. Maybe there's a reason I'm nervous. Yeah. Feels like I'm being prepared for something again. Another boss fight? I don't know. But what I do know is, I'm gonna go across to the chest, grab that key, and then unlock that box. There you go. Is that it? Yep, just like that. Oh, there's a couple of things. A metal key for the administration room. There you go. And this, I suppose, is going to be for the elevator on the fourth floor? Right. Didn't expect to find it here, but... Okay. I... Is that the phone ringing? It is. Oh yeah, here we go. Here we go. It's working. That's it, Stephanie. I'm done listening to you. Finished. You got that? I can't explain. No, you screwed me. You knew that fucking piano monster was there, and you didn't tell me anything. That's true. Roberto, I, I was trying to... What? Trying to what, Stephanie? Because right now, all it seems like you're trying to do is get me killed. <laughs> okay, look, I understand why you're upset, but please just listen to me for a second. Okay. I'm sorry, all right? I waited by the statue as long as I could, but as soon as I heard the piano start to play, I had to run. I thought he would have been long gone by now. Otherwise, I never would have told you to meet me there. 
I know that none of this makes any sense to you right now, but I need you to understand one thing. If we want to get out of here alive, we need to work together. You know, working with you and getting out of here alive don't really seem like they go together all that well. <laughs> no. Ricardo, you don't have a choice. There's no way out from the main levels anymore. The other survivors closed off every single entrance and exit throughout the hotel. All of them. Yeah, I can see that. Jesus Christ. Is this some kind of sick joke? How can I trust a word you say after everything you've put me through? Hey, if you want to risk your life searching around the hotel for an escape route that doesn't actually exist, be my guest. Hmm. Okay. Didn't think so. Now listen up. There's a large laboratory underneath the hotel. Right. And there's only one way to get down to it. Oh. Below the statue on the eighth floor, ah. there's a passage that will lead you to an elevator. To access this passage, you need to go into the administration office and open the safe next to the desk. Okay. Inside it, you'll find more information. This is really important. The girl needs your help. Oh, shit. Whoa. Oh, boy. Okay. I knew there was something. Right, that's got to be Lobster Man, right? Surely. Hang on. Let me pick this up. And let me go through here. Right. <laughs> you can't get me now. Oh, boy. Okay, so we need to go back up there. We need to open a safe. She didn't mention a safe combination or anything like that. I guess it's just going to be unlocked. Is anyone coming through? I don't think so. Right. Well, um, by the sounds of it, those doors that I came through might be opened again. So, yeah. Let's see. Oh, man. Let's reload this. Come on, come on. There you go. Yeah, they're open again. It's like he was chucked straight through them. So where is the big man? He's around. There he is. Oh man. Oh. He is pissed. Okay, right. Still can't kill it, right? Presumably. Let's see. Up here then? Okay, I need you out of the way. Bloody hell, okay. This machine gun isn't as good as I first thought it was going to be. Oh shit, what? What's this? Oh Christ, okay, I do not like this at all. Oh, okay, right. Oh shit, I didn't kill it, I didn't kill it. Right, have we got bugs around here as well? Oh, oh I'm not liking the squirming, the squelching that I can hear. Uh, might have to go this way, I think. Ah, uh, maybe not actually. Oh, this is open. Oh, hang on. Right. Have I got time to have a look? I got a note. Stay down. Stay down. What we got? Okay, hang on. I can hear him coming. I can hear him coming. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. There's a safe or something. Right, I've got to go. I've got to go. I've got to go. Right, here we go. Breaking right now. Oh, fuck. Okay, well, uh, we got to go up the stairs then, haven't we? I did this before. I know this route pretty well. So, right, yeah, it's got to be this way. Oh, man. Okay, he's dead. He's going to stay dead. We're going to go this way. Um, we're going to go through this wall if we can. Surely he won't be able to follow us through here. All right. Okay. I suppose this is going to lead back to the elevator, isn't it? And I've got that little... Oh, God. It's so dark. What's happening? Is he despawned? I think maybe he's despawned. I don't think he could follow me through this wall. I outran him again. The next time I see him, he is going to be even more mad. Holy shit. Right. So, there's an issue with the elevator? I don't like the look of that. I don't like the sound of that. Yeah, it looks like he's gone. Looks like he's gone. Yeah, let's take another look at this. Yeah, the panel's busted up. So does that mean... Oh, we, I guess we can't call the elevator here. Maybe we can still go down to this floor, but... Right. Let's see. Did I miss anything down here? There was this little safe, right? I can't use it? What about this book? 
A journey into the mind. Okay. Something down here. Oh, come on. Don't tell me I returned for nothing. Well, let's see. Oh, oh wow. It's like a server system or something like that. I don't suppose I can unplug anything or anything quite like that, can I? No. And this side? Alright. Wow. See, I just want to know what's going on here. And I'm sure many of you do as well. It's an intriguing story. Right. Yeah, okay, well, I've got this. It is for the fourth floor. That's where we're going. Back up the stairs we go. Anyone up here? Anyone in my way? No? Alright, so let's fix another one of these. There you go. And I suppose we've just got to twist these all around so everything kind of makes sense, right? Just like that. Okay, it's fixed. Right. Okay, I'm calling the elevator. Right, so I can call the elevator from the fourth floor, but I don't have a fourth floor button, so I can't get down here from the elevator. How confusing. Oh, man. Right. I don't know, maybe I've just missed a button somewhere. Okay. Alright. So now what? Do we go up to the eighth floor? Do we try out the administration area? I think so. Yeah. Man, oh, man. I've been all over the place in this video. Okay. Any more enemies? No? It doesn't look like it. Right. So it's underneath you, is it? Interesting, interesting. Right, up there. I should be able to open the door, and there should be a safe inside, right? If what Stephanie told me is true. Right, so let's use this. And let's get inside. Alright, this is the admin area, and there's somewhere to save. Good, it's been a while. Okay. Alright. Oh, starting off with the shotgun shells. Thank you very much. What have we got down here? Prophet Christopher's statue. The statue holds a chalice that the prophet used in his preaching. A beautiful stained glass with a very peculiar date. Wait, the 18th of September 2060. Interesting. Right, okay. Wait, 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 wait. Is that... It's just over there. That's got the date of 2060? Man, alright. Uh, let's go back to the book. Anything else? Uh, yeah, looks like it. There's a chalice in the administration room, and it's really beautiful. I've placed here an old coin that I found. Ah. I photographed this box that has a special lock. I wonder what's inside. Okay. That's in here as well, isn't it? Okay. And there's more. I found some old drawings. They all have the same symbol. Looks like not everyone faithfully believed in the Prophet. The gates were open. This he did not foresee. A lot of fours. Okay. And then I found strange writings in some places. Quod liberum arbitrium a principle. Is it Latin? Sounds like Latin, but I don't know what it means. Something about free will. Yeah, maybe that sort of mantra that they repeat. Okay. Looks like that's the end. So, right. There's a chalice in the admin room, and it's really beautiful. There's an old coin. Right, I'm curious about that. Where's that going to be? Right. Uh, there's a chalice that's missing, actually. Right. Maybe I'm going to need this to open the passage under the statue. It's not that one? No? Hmm. Okay. Uh, this would be the safe. And yeah, it, it needs a combination. What was the combination, Stephanie? Thanks for all your fucking help. Uh, she just likes giving me half the information I need, doesn't she? Right, here we go. Another upgrade item. Got a photo here. An old photograph with writing in Latin? Oh, on the back. It's that thing again, isn't it? Yeah. Hmm. Something down here? Uh, yes. Pistol bullets. Machine gun bullets. I feel I'm being prepared for something again. Nothing down there? The other side? No? Uh, adhesive plaster. Okay, cool. Look at this. All 
this closed circuit television. Someone was here keeping an eye on everything that I was doing. Or at least, they could have been. I don't know if that's the case, but... Right. So yeah, this box... Ah, uh, well, I, <laughs> I've got the key this time, but... Uh, I'm gonna need that last part. When do I get that last bit? I, ne I need to open the box again, don't I? Yeah, I, I need to solve that puzzle. There's some gears or cogs that I'm missing, I'm pretty sure. What we got on this side? Okay. More bullets. Something down here? Uh, nothing that I can pick up. Right. I did see the handprint there, so let's have a look, shall we? Oh, oh, here we go. Here's the combination. So it's 35, 5, 30. Like that. Yeah? Yes. Okay, right. What we got in here? Fibonacci. Uh, okay. Like I was going to play it. On the piano, right? Yeah, there was like a... Here we go! The missing piano keys! I was just going to say there was a missing piano key, but there you go. Right, okay, so uh, that's another puzzle that I can try. Hmm. I think I need to put these in that piano that's back in the ballroom. Oh, what's this? A small gear. Oh, it's part of the puzzle cube! Ah, right! Right, okay. Um. So yeah, I need to take that back down to the piano. I need to put that in the box. We have a save point here. Do we not have a chest? I don't think we do, annoyingly. Ah, oh, shit. Here we are, then. Let's add the small gear to the cube. There you go. Right, so let's let's use this again. Let's see if that actually makes a difference. Right, so now we've got three of these gears to choose from. Okay. Uh, right. Uh, that looks like it fits perfectly there. Uh, this big one? That goes there? Maybe that small one can be connected down here. There you go. Hey! Okay, green's good, right? Um, I guess we need to do the same kind of thing for the other two? Alright, I don't need to do them all at once, thankfully. Um, if that goes there... No, that doesn't fit. What about if that was... There? Hmm. Hey, okay, we've got the right one. It's just the middle one that I need to figure out, it seems. Okay. Uh, so let's move that over there, I guess. And, um, hmm. Let's see, maybe the small one goes there. And, oh, uh, maybe, maybe, hang on. If I move that one there... Can that one go on to the right? Yes! There you go! Look at that! Okay, that's all I needed, that one small gear. We've got three greens, and welcome back to the room. Is that it? That's it, that's metal piece number four. Right, amazing. So does that mean... Okay, it looks like we're done with the metal cube. We're not going to find another part of the key. There's no more puzzles to complete. That has served me well, but it's being discarded. This, however, is being combined with this key. Right, there you go, I've got all four parts. So yeah, on the seventh floor, there's that safe. I think there's been a couple of other little things that I maybe could have unlocked with it. There's that box, of course, in the admin room. Right, okay. Uh, but here I am in one of the mezzanine areas. I'm actually very close to the piano. Let's see if we can get down to the piano, shall we? Down here, right? Pretty much back to where I started this video. Oh, hello. <laughs> I'm not alone. Whoa! Okay. Right, there you go. Hmm. Why are you still lit up? There you go. That's why. I'm hearing more growling. More enemies, I think. Yep, yeah, there you go. Alright. 
Well, these guys I can deal with. I just don't want to deal with another piano monster. Right. Okay, so let's see. There you go. Right. Uh... So this is gonna this is gonna be the, the Fibonacci sequence, presumably. So it's gonna be zero and then one. And then another one. And then what two and three and five? And then eight? How far does this go up? Oh wow. Wait, fif fifteen? Hang on, hang on. Uh so let's have a look at the documents. And yeah. Well, there's not 15 different numbers there, so, right. Surely this is what we need to do, though. Five and five? That must be it. That didn't happen last time. Oh, that's the sequence that gets the statue out of the way? That puzzle took me a while, by the way. I tried many different things. Yeah, it's actually a lot more simple than I thought it was going to be. Right, there you go. That's the access that I was looking for. Amazing. Okay, yeah, can we take a look at that again? Yeah, so <laughs> initially what I was doing was I was getting, I was getting to like 5 and 8 and then I was counting to the right, like 9, 10, 11, 12, then going back over to the left and that key would be 13 and then I was counting again and again and there's 21, but no. You just sort of like write out 13, 1, 3, then 2, 1, 3, 4, 5, 5, and well, there you go. Looks like I can continue on playing. Up to 32 if I want. Right. Awesome. Okay. Right. I'm here on the seventh floor because there's a safe that I want to have a look in. And that safe is over here. Right. So, we've got four symbols. But we've got four parts of the key. I should be able to get in. Just like that, yeah? Alright. It's open, and there you go. Alright, an upgrade item. One of those spherical ones. So that's five. Is that it? I think... Ah, there's a coin. A metal coin. Wait. Was that, was that the coin that was mentioned in the book that goes in the chalice, or... I, I can't pick this up? Oh man. Huh, alright. Well, I was hoping I was going to find a little bit more than an upgrade, but there you go. Right, let's go open that box on the 8th floor now. Like that? Yeah. There you go. Another upgrade item. And... Uh, hmm. This I'm not so sure about. It might be 4-4-4 four, 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 though, right? Let's try that. Because there were a load of 4s in that book. That's what I'm thinking. No. No, that's not it. Right. I don't know if I'm going to be able to open the box within a box quite yet. Hmm. But what I am able to do is head down there. But that's what we're going to be doing in the next video. For now, I'm going to say thank you very much for watching part 4 of Phobia, St. Dymphna Hotel. I am thoroughly enjoying this game. Hopefully, you're still enjoying the series. If you are, leave this video a like. Leave your thoughts down below in the comments. Anything like that really does help me out. And I hope to see you back for part 5 very soon when we head down there and see what awaits us. I can't wait. See you then. What a convoluted way around. <laughs> what are we got in here? Uh, ooh, maybe that's going to help with a, a safe or two, or, no, maybe that's another memory. Another one, what's that, four? Ne I got four, okay. I know that guy wrecked me in the last boss fight, but I'm not that bad, guys. You know what? Fuck this. <laughs> Come on. Whoa, 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 whoa. It's got a skull and crossbones on it. Oh, dear. Am I going to be a pirate if I open this? I kind of hope so. I'm noticing in the top right that there's a date. There you go. Oh, how dramatic. <laughs> Just so long as you die like the others. Let me go through here. Right. 
<laughs> you can't get me now! This machine gun isn't as good as I first thought it was going to be. Oh shit, what? I outran him again. The next time I see him, he is going to be even more mad. A beautiful stained glass with a very peculiar date. Wait, the 18th of September 2060. Interesting. Ah, uh, this would be the safe. And yeah, it, it needs a combination. What was the combination, Stephanie? Thanks for all your fucking help. That's all I needed, that one small gear. We got three greens, and welcome back to the room.